everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna be doing a what I eat in the day video because I've not done one of these before and they are so requested, so highly requested on my channel. So um, I'm starting off on my balcony at the moment. Love just like chilling on my balcony and chatting, I don't know why. Um, so I am gonna start off this video. I have already had my breakfast this morning. I had Weetabix with, um, I like put raisins in my Weetabix and then just milk, like it's not anything interesting at all. So I've already had that and now I'm gonna head on and have lunch. I work out quite a lot so um, I tend to have two lunches. I tend to have one around 12 and then one at like two o'clock-ish. Um, just so that I have more like fuel on my body and that I'm eating enough to like keep up with the amount of exercise that I do and obviously I'm not looking to lose any weight so I need to make sure I eat enough so that I don't lose weight from all the exercise which I do. So that's kind of my um, method. So I'm gonna go ahead and make the first lunch of my day, which I usually have. I do just wanna briefly mention that I am not vegan, nor am I vegetarian or anything like that. I don't feel like I owe you a disclaimer to it, but I do feel like I have to mention it because everybody eats differently. Saying that, I do find veganism and um, eating vegetarian lay. <laughs> um, really interesting so I don't know I might do like a couple days where I eat vegan I might vlog them or I might do like a week trying veganism I don't know I'm just very interested in it but I'm gonna go ahead and make my lunch right now So I'm currently making pasta. Pasta with tomatoes and mozzarella, which I'm going to add in at the end. So I'm just making pasta currently. And I'm making enough so that I can bring it to uni tomorrow for my lunch as well. has been made I'm just gonna grab my iPad so that I can watch Stranger Things let me know if you guys are watching Stranger Things at the moment or if you finished it please don't spoil anything for me because I'm a slow Netflix watcher well of Stranger Things so that I can enjoy it for longer so don't ruin it for me don't leave any spoilers down below I'm gonna trust you guys I've just finished making my lunch I have made um tomato and mozzarella pasta i pop some butter in it just so that it's like not so dry and then i've also just got some like diluting juice it's there i really struggle to drink water but if i put diluting juice in it i mean of course i'm sure it has a bunch of sugar in it and whatever but if i add like a little bit of dilutingness into it it just makes everything so much easier to drink and i can get through so much more water in a day if i add diluting juice don't pick on me for being a child. Also, I think I'm gonna do like a shop today for food because I don't have much food left in my fridge. So I'm gonna go shopping today, which means I will show you guys what I buy once I get home. So you can have like a little mini grocery haul, grocery shop haul. I don't know if that's interesting, but I'll include that towards the end of this video. I'm gonna eat my pasta. So I've just written out on my little notepad here kind of the stuff which I'm going to pick up at the shops. I like doing this just so I have an idea of what I need to buy and also so I don't waste food because I'm on a budget and I don't want to waste money or food. So I've just done that and I will show you guys once I'm back from the shops what I picked up for any of you who are interested in what I buy when I go shopping. I will check in with you guys later once I'm back from the shops. 
I think I'm just gonna go to like Lidl or something even though there's limited choice there it's closer for me and it's cheap so I think I'm gonna head there I'm back from doing my shopping and as promised I'll give you like a mini haul I don't know how interesting you're gonna find this but I'll do one anyway and then I need to make some more food because I've not eaten in a little while but my whole thing came to 29 yep yeah, that's not gonna focus 29 euros and 64 cents which is pretty okay this shop will probably do me until like um Friday probably I think eggs free range because I'm trying to be as nice as I can carrots 11 uno lemon broccoli I got some granola honestly I'm such a sucker for chocolate granola is the best thing ever so I picked up this yeah I can't help it some kale I was originally looking for spinach but I couldn't find any so kale is just as good one potato ginormous mango four tomatoes uh, two sweet potatoes then two packets of chicken these are only like two breasts I think or three I don't know but I decided to get two because one was not big enough for my liking then I got some porridge I feel like this is such a weird packaging for porridge like I'm not used to it looks like flour honestly bizarre and I like to have porridge in the morning or before the gym porridge before the gym gives you so much energy would recommend also got some yogurt I go through about one of these a day so I just picked up another one then this is not food but I really want to buy a hair mask so this one wasn't too badly priced so I picked this one up it's by Garnier so I trust that it'll be okay for my hair then I found these in like the bio section so like the organic section they look really cool I mean I could totally make them myself because they're just yogurt and granola but for uni, I have a lot of really early starts. Like, I'm not even joking. I get on the train at, like, 6 in the morning. It's ridiculous. So, I thought these would be really cool to snack on on the train or during my first class. And then again, along the lines of, like, breakfast, early mornings, these look like fake Belvitas. And they have, like, jam and, like, yogurt-y stuff in the middle. And I really like the Belvita versions. So I thought I would get these ones, again, to have in the morning as a snack. Probably not the most healthiest things, but, like... They taste good. I also picked up some milk. Boring. Yep. Standard. And two bottles of these. So this is everything pretty much which I picked up. Two chicken. Like everything just chilling there. And as I said, this will probably last me like five days. Don't know. So I'm just going to pop all this now into the fridge as you can see and then I'm gonna do some uni work for a couple hours no I'm not I'm gonna make some food first of all and then I'm gonna do some uni work and then I think I might go to the gym okay meal number two or lunch number two I don't really know what to call this it's basically like a big snack which I have kind of at like two half past two three o'clock I don't know I just have two lunches I kind of just eat when I'm hungry basically anyway for meal number two I am gonna be cooking some of the chicken which I made and I think I'm just gonna do like some sort of chicken wrap like nothing too hard Whilst the chicken is cooking currently, I'm having some chocolate because lint chocolate is so good and it's so cheap here. In the UK it's like premium chocolate and you have to pay so much for lint, but it's so cheap here so I just, I can't help but keep buying it and I know it's terrible, but it's so good, so. Who wants you to show me love? This is 
My second mini meal of the day, I've just got carrots, chicken, and also some salad with some sweet chili sauce in there. And I'm just gonna eat this as like a mini meal snack before I do some uni work. just making some porridge before I go to the gym I feel like porridge gives you so much energy and it's so easy to make so I just basically added a little bit of Greek yogurt in my porridge as well as like half a scoop of vanilla protein so I think that makes it like 12 and a half grams of protein so not much but just enough to give it like a little bit extra so that's just currently being heated in the microwave and then I'll eat that before I go to the gym in like half an hour's time. And then I'm just gonna add some jam. It's burning my fingers. I'm back from the gym right now. I'm just gonna start making my dinner. I'm thinking I'm gonna make one of my like go-to super easy student -y meals, which I'll show you how I make. And I think my eyelashes are looking really funky. Please excuse my appearance. I've just come back from the gym. So, I'm gonna start making this and I'll let you guys know how I do it because it's so easy to do. It's all vegan friendly, I believe. So it suits everyone. So I'm just gonna get started and I'll show you guys what I'm gonna have for my dinner because it's super tasty. my dinner um about half an hour ago to an hour ago now I just went and had a shower and got myself ready for bed I'm in my pajamas at the moment just chilling on my bed and I'm gonna go and watch some Netflix right now obviously for my tea I added some chicken on the top I just did that purely because I'd been at the gym and I wanted a little bit of protein and um, a little bit extra protein to be mixed in with my meal but if you didn't add the chicken, it would totally be vegan and veggie friendly. And as my final kind of like snack meal of the day, I am just having um, a banana with some Greek yogurt and I popped a little bit of jam as well in there just because um, it adds a little bit of flavour and sweetness. Obviously I've taken off my makeup because I'm heading to bed right now as well. So I hope this video helped give you a little bit of insight into what I roughly eat in a day. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did like it, then I would love it if you hit the thumbs up button and subscribe down below as well. That would also make me happy. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys and I will see you soon in my next video. Tell me